Wayne here with Full Sail Marketing. So I want to talk on a subject today that you've possibly never even thought about. Uh, and that's actually why Facebook Live is important for your contracting company. So the reason why Facebook Live is really so important, it's because over the past few weeks and past few months, Facebook's actually been changing its algorithm for how much it's showing the posts. Everything that you write, every video that you post onto your business's Facebook page, it's not getting shown to all the people that like and follow your page. I mean, in, in the past, you know, a few years ago, every single person that liked and followed your page would see everything that you post. But just with people having more and more friends, more and more followers, following more and more businesses, it's impossible to show all of the content to everybody. Now Facebook's actually just toning it down less and less and less. Uh, it's unfortunate, but there's ways to combat it. And the number one way is with Facebook Live. So first off, uh, statistics came out beginning of 2018 that Facebook Live actually now has six times the amount of engagement as regular posts and regular videos. When I say engagement, it's those likes, those hearts, those comments. And that's what you want. And you want the longer and longer comments if possible. So I know Facebook Live can be something pretty intimidating, no doubt about it. It's intimidating to me, to our entire team, the first time we started using it also. So I'm here to give you a few tips and tricks on what you can do and uh, really not to be afraid of it, not to be worried at all. So the first thing that uh, Facebook Live is really, really great for is breaking news. Now in the contracting industry, what I like to think about for this a lot of times is you know seasonal things or just if there's something with the weather happens uh, that just pops in your head that you want to update, some sort of breaking news that you think your clients or your potential customers would be interested to know, interesting knowledge, that's breaking news. It's something that you know could potentially spark a conversation even better. Now, don't be afraid to really just get your phone out, start a conversation, even if it's 20 seconds long, like just one quick tip, people are gonna watch it over and over again. Um, the interactions and the engagement that's six times, it actually keeps going after the Facebook Live ends also. So even after it's ended and people keep rewatching it, you're gonna get boosted higher, higher and higher in Facebook and more and more people are going to be able to see it, okay? So the next thing really that I like to suggest is live events. Um, contractors especially are going to live events a lot, you know? They're super in touch with what's happening in the industry. They always wanna stay at the forefront of everything and anything there might be. And think about it, like, you're, you're going into these live events because you wanna learn. Now you have the privilege of taking other people with you, of showing a little almost behind the scenes of these live events. So, you know, if, if you hear a cool stat at the live event or it's in a cool location or you meet somebody interesting, Click that Facebook Live button and just give it a quick update on what's going on. Something that I don't think a lot of people realize is that don't put so much pressure on yourself to create content. Try and more document or curate content. Like just what you're already doing in the day to day is a lot more interesting than you think. Maybe to you it seems boring because it's your day to day every day, but to other people, it's going to be pretty interesting. So give it a shot. You have absolutely nothing to lose. Okay. And then the last thing, the last tip and trick that I want to give here with Facebook Live is to literally do that. Give some tips and tricks to your audience, some free value. Um, don't think that you're going to give away some big secret and then they're never going to buy from you or they're never going to become a customer because you know, those people, there's some of them out there that are just looking for free advice. They were never your customers anyways, right? They were never going to buy from you. There's people like that just in the world. But the people who just wanted a little bit more knowledge, right? They just want to understand a little bit more before they buy. Now that you gave them that free information, you gave them some cool tips and tricks they might want to know. 
all the better. They're going to be uh, a customer of yours in the future. So maybe show a little behind the scenes of a build or of a, a renovation or whatever it might be. Even like going to buy supplies if you have like a, a special tip and trick that maybe a homeowner that's doing his own renovations or, or whatever, if they could use it, give them that tip and trick. They're, they're really, really going to appreciate it. <coughs> um, and it's as easy easy as that, guys. So give, uh, give Facebook Live a chance. I promise you won't be disappointed. It can only help your business. The only way that it can hurt your business is if you literally start screaming at your phone. People make mistakes. All right, I, I literally made it a goal for in this video to just do it in one take. Um, I was kind of, I guess I didn't stumble or mess up too much, but it doesn't matter. Be human, be transparent. That's what people want to see because that's, that's who we all are. So hope this helped guys. Um, please reach out if you have any questions and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks.